Hey, buddy. Time to get up. Ready for a brand new day? Yeah? Suffers. Hey. You ready for a brand new day? All right, let's get up. It's like, get that camera out of my face, boy. Get that camera out. Hey, guys. I don't know if I've showed you all the backyard or not. I feel like I have. So I'm just going to give you all a brief little overview. That's one side. We have a coolie. And that's the other side. Brief overview of the backyard. So if you boy all might be asking, what the heck is a coolie? It's basically like a drainage ditch that's really, really big. And it goes throughout uh, the city. And it brings water all the way to the Vermilion River. That's what a coolie is. Me and Conrad used to go down as young boys. And he had a coolie behind his house. We would take his butterfly knife and go kill snakes and smash up stuff that we found down there. One time we found a door, one time we found a microwave, just a bunch of random stuff. It is a beautiful day outside and it's not that cold. That is fantastic. Alrighty, I guess I should go and do some more work. Work, 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 work. Zephyrs, want to come outside? Zephyrs, it's a beautiful day. Oh, where'd he go? He was right there. There's the Zephyrs. I think he's about to go make a poopy. Zephyr's making a poopy. Okay, I'm not gonna show you all that, cause that's gonna be gross. Gross! I'm trying to start getting the cat outside. I'm trying to see if he'll go outside. He hasn't been going outside much and he needs exercise cause he is fat, 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 fat. So we're gonna see if we can get him out. Let's turn down this heater though. It is too hot up here. Come on, buddy. Come on. Yeah, look at you coming outside. All right, getting used to it. It's a beautiful day. Come on. Come on, Zephyrs. So a guy came over just now. He's a door-to-door -door salesman, obviously. He's selling me some, some product here. InstaClean. It's uh, made by a company, Action Products, in, here in Louisiana. It's a concentrate, so you need a 10 to 1 water dilute with it. But this guy was showing me this stuff, and it looks... Pretty awesome. I'm going to show you everything that he just uh, walked through my house and, and checked out for me. We have this table here, which right here is all rusted, like down here. Cleaned it up, and he also did it right here. I mean, you can see the difference there. So that was pretty amazing. He did my headlight here. Nice shine on there. Feels good. This nail right here. The whole thing was covered with rust, and he just kind of brought it back. There's a big old rust stain right here, bigger, more than this. And he sprayed it down here, and it took it right up. This wood, he, he brought back the color to it, the brown. It's not this dingy color, which is quite interesting. I want to play with that some. He had a pen, and he marked up on a uh, towel, and then he uh, rubbed it out with his bottle. And it just came right up. Blue, blue ink. See this thing? It's all nasty and whatnot. He sprayed some right on the side here. And it's cleaning it up. My door, see it's got this grossness there. He shined it up right there. That's Mike over there! <laughs> oh look, he did my tire here too. It was all rusted like this. See how that's all rusted? He came in and rubbed it in some right there. And it got rid of the dinginess. It's still, I think that's just kind of how it's going to be. What else do you have? Bugs. You got some bugs off the front here. Hey guys, so we watched Hurt Locker last night, and I told you guys that I would give y'all my review of it whenever I saw it, and I thought it was good. Whoever put it together, it did a really good job of making each scene really, really intense. It's up for nine Academy Awards. One of them was uh, Best Sound, and the sound in it is really good. They have a great use of silence in the film, which I am a fan of. Although, one scene in particular, they were going for the effect of it feeling like they were there for a really long time, and it drug along too long, I think. Uh, I think the point was gotten a few minutes into you know a few minutes of that scene. It was a decent movie. Best picture, 
Mm, I think Avatar is probably still going to beat it. Best cinematography. Kind of want a lot of shaky camera and really quick zooms in and stuff like that. I'm not a fan of all that. All in all, though, it was a good movie, good storyline, uh, good intense scenes. I enjoyed that. A couple of people I mentioned that I was on Twitter on Twitter that I was watching the movie, and a few of the responses of people at the Todd Newberg said it's real good. Radham said Hurt Locker is the next big release on my must watch list. It's intent from start to finish, right? Uh, Lindsay underscore Patton said I've seen it, great movie. I doubt it'll beat Avatar for best movie or best director though. At Dunlap said I saw it. I don't think it was amazing enough to warrant the nine nods though. It seems like a lot of us are on the same page about it. At Midna said I've seen it a while ago uh, but didn't like it too much. Kind of like, eh, you know, it was a good movie, but it shouldn't have won all. It's, I don't think it warrants all these awards that were out there. So it's a good movie. I'd say go check it out. Uh, is it going to win? I don't think so. Avatar is probably going to steal the show. Just kind of tweaking some things on the blog. I updated my MySpace page if y'all want to check that out. And now it's time to go to bed. Good night. Oh, we watched Survivor tonight. The new episode, it was good. Hey, subscribe. And don't forget to rate this five stars. Favorite this video. Leave me a text comment. And also, please give me a video response. La, 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 la. And share this video with all your friends on YouTube and elsewhere. <laughs>